Early in meiosis one, homologous chromosomes assemble, cross over, form complex chiasma, and at the end of meiosis one, the spindle apparatus will attach the centromeres and separate them. In order of tetrads, the physical order of, of these chromatids will be revealed in the physical order of gametes and ascus. Let's imagine that crossing over occurs between here and here, at the same time between here and here, and here and here, and here and here, and here and here, and here and here. This is rather complicated, but possible. It's a good example as to how to understand how to treat these chiasma. To predict, to determine what the outcome of the gametes will be in which order, we can follow each of the crossing over events by starting at a centromere so that, and moving out to the top. That would predict wild type A following this down, null B, C and D. Using a different color for the second chromatid, down, we would get null A, working out again, a little bit complicated, while type at B, null at C, while type at D. Using orange for the third chromatid, we predict while type at A, null B, while type C, and D. Using purple for the lowermost, I have to be a little bit careful here because the gray crossing over lines are a bit obscured. It goes up and down here, which is null at A, wild type at B, C, wild type, D, null. If I did this correctly, I should see in the diagram the no colored line is crossing, uh, overlapping, overlaying one locus more than once. And I can do a ch simple checksum because the input should equal the output. And I started with something that was heterozygous. So after the duplication of the sister chromatid, I have two plus and two null at each locus. And I see I have two of each, two of each, two of each, two of each. The diagram looks correct. In an ordered tetrad, this physical order would be preserved in that these two chromatids, these two gametes, would be physically next to each other, and these two be physically next to each other. Which one's on top, which one's on bottom? The relationship of the top to the second, whether which one's at the extreme and which one is interior, and this way doesn't matter. So there's many possible ways to indicate this but always in this show it's shown the red would be next to the green and the orange next to the purple.